Hi everyone, welcome to a very exciting session where I'll show you how to connect Jupyter Notebook with Spider Kernel. The basic requirement for this is you should have Anaconda installed along with that you will have Jupyter and the Spider automatically installed. So let's start. The very first thing what we will do is we will run this Conda install Spider because if this is not installed you will not get the option in Spider. So like if you uh, see now here I am getting this paints and then in paints I can get the notebook option because I have already installed this command here. I have already ran this command conda install spider hyphen notebook hyphen c spider hyphen eid. Once you are done with it and you restart the spider editor only not the entire system it's your wish if you want to restart your system but only you need to restart the spider editor and then you will get this option enabled. So you have to do that. Okay, this and then after this use pane and the notebook option will come. The moment you hit this, select this notebook option here, you can see you are into the notebook of spider, like where you can get the Jupyter notebook in the uh, spider editor. So next target is as per my document, what is the next? We have done the task one and task two, install the spider notebook uh, API for uh, Jupyter. And then we all also install the enable the notebook option. Next is open a notebook. Okay, see this is my existing notebook. Okay, and this is the name is test demo one, and I have a list of variables here around df1, df2, df3, df4, df5, df6. So what I will go, I will go to my uh, spider editor, and in the in the spider notebook editor is open, and open the uh, notebook. Open. I'll give the test demo one okay i will open this notebook which is already opened there now so what i will do i will run all the cells here okay so you can see all my different variables is created now if you go and see here uh, i don't have any df a nothing is there okay because it is not being connected so as per my the steps what we have to do i need to open the notebook which i have already done the next target uh, is the we can connect by two methods okay so the method one is open the console from notebook in the top right so we will open from here open console okay here and you can see this is connected here. you can see here this i have con uh, i have executed the cell till it is 11 here right and then my console will start from um, cell number 12 and all that fields okay if you see here this is df1 which is nothing but p class and sex so if i go and open df1 you can see the p class and the sex information df2 is age and sibling is p okay df3 is df3 is whether you go here and get the information parch and df4 is fair df5 is df6 is the age column okay so that's all this is pretty simple we connect from this spider editor you go here and in the there's a cons open console option that is done now you will say that i don't want to use this option then i want to connect using this option of spider console okay so from here so what i will do i will just close this okay I will go here and then what I will do, I will say connect to an existing kernel and then browse. Okay. And then you see here the time. Okay. I have just saved it, executed it just two minutes back. So just open this. Okay. And you can see here, even he, I have 11 here and then the cell number value is 12 here. So we can further look into that. Okay. So you can see here all the values are coming uh, like variables are being displayed properly now what i will do i will close this okay and i will create one more cell i'll say df7 is equal to df5 plus df6 okay now this is being saved also i will go here and i will open connect to an existing kernel browse okay and then just open it Okay. 
so you can see and this is 13 and this is 14 here so it is being connected very nicely and you can see all the variables so this is one of the questions multiple people have asked me how to connect the jupyter notebook with spider kernel and this is how we can do it very easily so but please note before uh, like uh, doing this you need to ensure that you have uh, anaconda installed installed in your in your system which will uh, by default install jupyter and spider kernel and then after this you need to run this code for installing the api for spider notebook in the spider editor after this which you have to enable the option uh, for the notebook option spider editor and then open the notebook the way i have shown and then you have two ways first method is from here or connecting to a console and then the other method is like connecting to an existing kernel so that's it for the session thanks a lot for watching this session if you feel this video is helpful please press the like button and subscribe to this channel and i will see you in my next video thank you